accident. A routine flight takes a dangerous turn in the skies over Sandy and forces a pilot to make an emergency landing in a field. Nike's Mike Benner is live in Sandy, and Mike, this was an experienced pilot. It certainly is, Joe. His name is Wolf Edmonds. He's been flying for more than a decade, and he's been around planes even longer than that. In fact, he was born at an airport, but even the most experienced pilots can have problems in the air. And that's what happened tonight. Just after takeoff from the Sandy River Airport, the engine on Wolf's ultralight plane died, forcing him to make an emergency landing in a farm field of all places. I set up for an approach into the field and realized right away that I wasn't going to make the first field. And that meant I had to make what they call an impossible turn. I had to turn 180 degrees and, and line up on the second field. And the danger there is that you can get into a, a stall, spin, crash, burn, die scenario. And I wasn't in the mood to die today. Wolf tells us he mustered up as much speed as possible and put the nose down for an emergency landing. These photos illustrate what happened next. You'll notice the farm field was a bit too small, so the plane hit a barbed wire fence stopping just short of a road. The good news, both Wolf and his passenger escaped uninjured. He did an incredible job. I've flown with him before. I have my own plane out here. I would get in a plane with him right now. It's a bummer that a, a perfectly good airplane got bent up today, um, but we've got more of them, and we'll fix that one. And uh, I just follow your dreams, and, and aviation is mine, and I hope to inspire as many people uh, that I come in contact with. If you can't tell already, Wolf is the sort of guy who looks for the silver lining and everything. He tells us that tonight's ordeal brought neighbors out of their homes from all over the place, and he says they hadn't seen each other in a while, so in the end, it was a reunion of sorts. Back to you. That is quite a silver lining. Thank you, Mike. Now to a trap.